Kennedy with that corner. In with the header. 2-0. They could play. Wolverhampton Wanderers have clear daylight and have a glimpse. Just have a glimpse of the Premiership. Oh. Hello and welcome back to the second day of the Old Gold Advent. Today I'm talking about the Wolves 1. West Bromwich Albion nil from 2007, the 11th of March. It was the result that we'd all been waiting so many years for, having not played the Albion for five years, and then having lost to them 3-0 in the, at the Hawthorns, having lost to them 3-0 in the FA Cup when they had the whole of the South Bank. It was the result that we'd all been waiting for. We'd brought in a lot of new players in the January, Michael Mackindo, uh, Michael Kitely, and we started to look a little bit more of a better team than we did in the early part of that season. We'd been on a bit, little bit of a run coming up to that point and momentum was definitely with us. Albion had been falling away a little bit and we'd been clawing ground up on them. The game itself I remember being very very tight and just being able to hold them and be nil nil at half time I was quite happy with. I'd have been perfectly happy coming away from that game with a nil nil but it was the 83rd minute. Jay Bothroyd had not long come on. Little turn on the edge of the box shot across Dean Kiley and I remember Molyneux absolutely erupting. One of my favourite goals, one of my favourite moments as a Wolves fan, scraping all my shins off the back of the chair in front of me, jumping up and down so vigorously. And I remember really, really buzzing after that game. Well, the game after that, we lost to Coventry. It was on the it was the last game of a sort of six or seven winning streak, uh, which got us into the playoffs. Losing to Coventry then the next game, then getting battered the next weekend by Southampton 6-0, but then picking up a little bit uh, before the end of the season, before of course facing West Bromwich <laughs> again. But anyway, that game really stands out as a turning point for that season and a great win. Let me know your thoughts down below, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again tomorrow for another Old Gold Advent. Goodbye.